Wiley Fox is a brand that you've probably never come across, but this is its first smartphone, the Swift. And it's pretty good, especially when you consider that it only costs £129. With such a low price tag, you're naturally not getting bleeding edge specs, but what you do get isn't bad at all. Inside is a quad core Snapdragon 410 CPU, 2GB of RAM and 16GB of internal storage with a microSD card slot. Around the front is a 5 inch 720p IPS display with full lamination and it looks great. 720p isn't so much of an issue at this size uh, and it's bright and colourful to look at. Text does sometimes suffer but on the whole it's a pleasant thing to look at. For the software Wiley Fox went with CyanogenOS 12.1 instead of doing any of the heavy lifting at their end. It's a good pairing too as the software is slick and responsive and being Cyanogen comes without usual manufacturer bloat and custom skins. You can of course theme the Swift with Cyanogen's theme store which does require an account but the stock options are a plain old Android look or a more orange toned Wiley Fox theme that replaces the app drawer button with the company's logo. Heading to the rear of the phone and the back cover is covered in a black sandstone finish that has just the slightest of textures. It's nice, it also comes off presenting the 2500 mAh removable battery, dual SIM card slots and the micro SD card slot. And finally turning to the camera. The rear camera is a 13 megapixel backside illuminated sensor from Samsung paired with a dual LED flash. And there's a 5 megapixel unit around the front. This is a cheap phone though remember, so expectations should be kept in line, but it's also not a horrible camera. Paired with the Cyanogen camera app as standard, we've been able to get some not displeasing shots from this £129 phone. For the money the Swift looks like exceptional value, it's very hard to fault and it's a genuine contender in the budget arena so long as Wiley Fox can actually get people to go for it over a more established brand like, for example, Motorola with the Moto G. Stay tuned for our full review, and thanks very much for watching.